This is question number 24, 2020 KCSE Mathematics Paper 2, and we are told the table below shows the number of students in each class in a school. The percentage of students in each class where grasses is also shown. So we have class form 1 up to form 4. There are 60 students in form 1, 50 in form 56 in form 2, 44 in form 3, and 40 in form 4. The percentage is also given 10% of those who are in form 1 wear grasses, 12.5% in form 2, 25% in form 3, and we have 17.5% in form 4. A student is chosen at random uh, from the school, determining the probability that the student is a form 4. So how many students are there in form 4? probability that uh, the student is a form 4 is equals to we have 40 students if you add up this to this the num total number of students in that school this is a hundred this is a hundred there are 200 so we have 40 over 200 which when you simplify you get 1 over 5 which is the same as 0 0.2 so that is the probability that the student chosen at random is a form 4 uh, we have Roman number two. The probability that the the student wear grasses. Uh, it is important. Let's make a three diagram to make it easier uh, for that calculation. So we have a student could be in form one, a student could be in form two, a student in form three, a student in form four. So with that, we can say. Uh, we can write the probability here. So you ca you write the probability. If you divide 60 divided by 200, you get it is 0 0.3. You get uh, 56 divided by 200, you get it is 0 0.28. Uh, you divide 44 divided by 200, you get it is 0 0.22. And uh, finally, you have 40 divided by 200, you get 0 0.2. So those are the probability. So we can also have uh, the probability that the form one student wear grasses. So we can say wear grasses does not wear grass uh, grasses. So we have ten percent, which is the same as zero point one. So the other one is zero point nine. Uh, then we have form two uh, could be wearing grasses, could not could not be wearing grasses. So we use that. Uh, 12.5, if you write in terms of decimal, uh, it is the same as 0 0.125. If you subtract the other one, it will be 0 0.875. Then uh, you got a student in form 3. Uh, it is 25%, so we can say it is 0 0.25 for a student to wear grass. Uh, this is grass and 0 0.75. It does not wear grass. Uh, then a student in form 4, the percentage is, we can say, 17.5. So you can write it as 0 0.175 uh, where grasses. And those who don't, we can write it as uh, 0 0.825. So with that, we can now be able to use the probability. So we say the probability that a student wear grass uh, we can write uh, this is a probability a student to a grass it is equal to the probability that a student is in, in form 1 0 0.3 uh, you can write that in, uh, in in a statement form but I don't have space you multiply by the probability that the student uh, wear grass is 0 0.1 uh, or which you use plus the probability that a student is in form 2, which we have said it is 0 0.28, uh, and we are grasses, which is 0. Point, uh, this is we have found it is 0 0.125. Uh, then we have uh, or, which we use plus, the, the student is in form 3, which we say it is 0 0.22. And we are grasses, which is 0 0.25. And finally, plus or, 
the probability that the student is in form 4 which is 0 0.2 and to wear glasses which is uh, 0 0.175 so you can compute that uh, let me use this space here and when you compute that using a calculator you'll be able to get this is equals to 0 0.2 265 so the probability that a student wear glasses is 0 0.265 but b the student chosen at random from school determine the probability that one of the student is a form one uh, while the other student is a form four so we can say probability that a student is a form one uh, and a form four a probability that one student is a four, four and a form four, then we can say this is a probability of choosing a form one student, which is 0 0.3, and a form four student, which uses multiplication. This is a form one student and a form four student. Form four student is 0 0.2, or which you have. You, you choose as, as a form four student, which is 0 0.2, you multiply by uh, 0 0.3 and that this is 0 0.3 and that should give you uh, 0 0.1 uh, let's put that correctly 0 0.12 so that is a probability that a student to uh, probability that one of the student is in form one while the other one is in form four trauma number two probability that the one of the student is a form one while the other is a form four and both they are grasses so we say the probability that uh, a student is, in a form, is a form 1 is 0 0.3 and where grasses uh, is 0 0.1 uh, and, and also a form 4 which is 0 0.2 multiply by 0 0.2 and where grasses which we multiply by 0 0.2 one seven five so that's one option um, or the probability that uh, the student is a form four which we say it is 0 0.2 and the way grasses which is 0 0.175 uh, you multiply by or a student is a form one uh, which is a uh, student is a form one which is 0 0.3 and we are grasses which is 0 0.1 so you can compute that let's write that 0 0.1 you can compute that uh, switch you can work it out and you'll be able to get 0 0.0021 so that's how you work out that question and uh, if you get to that stage you should be able to get 10 marks